As I am now, so you shall be. So prepare for death and follow me. No matter who you talk to in Dublin, has somebody buried in, in, in his last name. People do call it the National Cemetery. We've a huge amount of famous people buried here. My name is Shane Moctomoss, and I'll bring you on the tour this morning. Behind me is the grave of James Larkin, the trade union leader, Maud Gawne McBride, Countess Markovich. Well, Michael is always very popular. He would get, he gets balloons, flowers, yeah. Divalier it a bit, but very little. Definitely not as much as Michael Collins. There was this old lady, and she had long grey hair. They noticed that she had no finger. And Jem says, who cut her off? And she said, this little thing here. <laughs> Visiting a place of memory and mourning is important to Irish people. Occasions like Valentine's Day is a big thing in our family. She always has to have her a bunch of flowers. You have many graves in Irish graveyards where you have a kneel and pray. And there's one in Glasnevin you read, sit and chat. Seen a lot over the years, a lot of sadness. It's actually hardened me towards death, really. We never ever get used to death, even in our business. I would like to think there is something after death. If you want to be a hero, you need to be five things. You need to be young, charismatic, good-looking, intelligent, and dead, yeah, 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 yeah. It's a remarkable place, and it lifts my spirit to work here.